Here's a perfect pair for field recording and Foley sound effects. I'm Steve with Puzzle Audio, and today we're going to record some sound effects. The Rode NTG3 mic has a super cardioid polar pattern, and its narrow focus is perfect for capturing the sounds you want while rejecting everything else. The blimp is used to reduce handling and wind noise, and while it's probably not necessary for today's indoor project, it's not going to hurt anything to install it. The shock mount handle assembly is easy to operate. Just loosen the screws, remove the back, slide out the shock mount, and the handle and assembly is all prepared ready for you to install the microphone. Once the mic is installed between the two Rycoat Lyre shock mounts, you can see that it's well secured and not likely to transfer any handling noise. This same blimp assembly can be used for Rode's enormous NTG8, and you can simply adjust the handle position to balance the blimp with larger microphones. Just slide the assembly back together. Be sure that it's seated all the way towards the front, otherwise the rear cap won't install correctly. And you can see, when I'll get close up here with the camera, there's very little room for error. Once you've verified that the assembly is pushed as far forward in the blimp as it can go, then you're ready to install the rear cap. And you'll see there's, uh, like I said, very little uh, room for error here. It's a, quite a tight tolerance. Now today I'm gonna be using the Zoom H6 Handy Recorder and some Sony MDR7506 headphones as part of my kit. Of course, I've got an XLR mic cable. Everything's ready to go. And now we're ready to record some sound effects. Well, you probably noticed I mentioned the Rode NTG3 as a great mic for voiceover. And just to prove that point, I've done the entire voiceover for this video with the Rode NTG3. See you next time.